Hi everyone, this is Anson from AnsonAlex.com and in this video I'm going to help you solve the problem of Facebook continually refreshing and scrolling and jumping all over the place. So here I am on my Facebook page and I'm not actually experiencing this issue right now but I have many times over the years and I've actually been providing a text-based article helping users solve the problem on my website and I thought it was time to do a video as well. So I'm going to post a link to this article because there are some solutions in here that require some copying and pasting, uh, specifically this one about disabling smooth scrolling, but I'm going to show you how to do that as well. Uh, in fact, let's just copy what we need to copy right now so we have that for later. So I'm going to try and go in order of least invasive uh, potential methods that you can use, and I'm going to talk about computers and mobile devices and everything. So first of all, what might be causing this problem? Well, there are a few things that may cause it. One could be a bad network connection. And so it's a good idea to just make sure that your internet's working well. You can obviously just go to another website and test it around, or you can go to speedtest.net and you can run a speed test for your internet connection. I'm not going to do that. I know my internet's working fine right now. So uh, that's how you can test your internet connection. You wanna be getting at least two gigabytes a second or more, depending on you know what type of network you're using. Facebook can run on less than that, but uh, nowadays, you know, that's a, a pretty kind of a minimum network speed that you should be shooting for. Okay, so that's pretty basic. Another thing that could be happening is a bug with a Facebook update. So Facebook may have updated their Android app or their iOS app or their browser app, and it caused a bug. So you can't really fix that bug on your own. You can submit a bug report, which I'll show you how to do, but some of these workarounds might help you use Facebook temporarily while that bug is fixed. So that could be another reason. And then you also may need to update your device or the application that you're using, whether that's a browser like this, Google Chrome, or the Facebook app on your iOS or Android device. So those are the reasons. What are the fixes? Well, first of all, a lot of these fixes have come from my own experience and the feedback I've gotten from viewers of my website. So one of the easiest ones is people say to make sure that you let the page load completely. So here we are on Facebook and a lot of times, you know, people are saying that they're loading a profile and then they start to scroll and they're, you know, able to scroll a little bit and then boom, Facebook kind of refreshes and it shoots them back at the top. And if they scroll again, it happens. And what people are saying is if you wait, if you let the page load and then wait before scrolling, uh, it will completely load and oftentimes it won't shoot you back to the top. So that's a pretty easy solution. It's just changing the way that you use Facebook. People also talk about the computer zoom level. So on a Mac computer, if you do command plus on a Windows computer, it's control plus, you can zoom in your browser. As you can see, I'm doing that right now. And then control minus on Windows or command minus on Mac zooms out the browser. Control zero or command zero will set it to 100%, which is your normal zoom level. So some people are saying that, you know, if they're really zoomed in and they load a profile page, scroll down, it, it's refreshing. So just hit control zero on a Windows computer or command zero on a Mac to make sure your zoom is set to 100%. And then I would probably, you know, refresh the page and see if that fixes your problem. And this one, you know, Hopefully a lot of you have already tried this, but uh, make sure that you restart your device. So whether it's an Android, iOS, regular computer, restart it, restart your browser if you're on a computer, you know, on iOS and Android, close the app, reopen it, definitely try all that. At the same time, you also wanna make sure everything's updated. So make sure your Facebook apps are updated, make sure Google Chrome's updated or Firefox or whatever you're using to use Facebook, make sure everything's updated, your operating system. Those are things that you probably wanna do anyways. So just, you know, get the updates done and see if that fixes the issue. You also might want to try using a different browser. You'll notice, you know, I'm in Google Chrome right now, uh, and this has happened over the years. You know, it's affected Chrome users, and so then they switch to Firefox, and it works, or it's affected Firefox users, and then they switch to Chrome, and it works. So whatever browser you're using, if you've tried all the other steps that I've mentioned and it's still not working, try a different browser. Again, this might be a Facebook bug for Chrome browsers that will be fixed in a week, and for that week, if you want to use Facebook, it might be better to use Firefox, even though it's not solving the problem, it's kind of a workaround. So try other browsers. And if you're on a mobile device and you really can't use the Facebook app because it keeps refreshing, you can go into whatever your browser is on that device, whether it's Safari or Chrome or Opera, whatever you're using, and you can go to facebook.com and then log in through the browser and hopefully use Facebook that way. If you're using a computer, you might want to try clearing your cache and cookies. So in Google Chrome, we can go up here to the three little dots on the right top right of our browser, and we can go to the More Tools dropdown, and then from here we can click on Clear Browsing Data, and then we could go in and we could clear all of our cookies and other site data and cached images and files and see if that fixes the issue. So I'm not going to do that for now, but definitely something that you wanna try if you haven't yet. Then this is something that you wanna do, and, and this is the thing that I copied earlier from 
my website. So if we open up a new tab here in Google Chrome and we paste in what I copied earlier, it's Chrome dot dot forward slash forward slash flags forward slash and then hit enter brings us to some experimental settings here in Google Chrome and this would work the same in Edge. You just type Edge here instead of Chrome. And then we're going to search for smooth scrolling when we get to this screen. Now you'll notice that I'm on a Mac right now using Chrome and it's not available. This isn't available for all computers and all apps. However, if I go to unavailable, you'll notice that here it is and it tells me that uh, this is a feature that can be turned on on Windows, Linux, Chrome OS, Android, Fuchsia and Lacros. So I'm on Mac, so I can't do this. However, on my Windows, I can. And what it will say is over here on the right, it'll just have it enabled or disabled option. And you can try disabling it and then just closing out this tab and then go back to Facebook, probably give it a refresh and see if that fixes your issue. If you're still experiencing the problem after trying all of these things, unfortunately, you may have to wait for Facebook to fix the problem. Like I said, I posted this solution, this article, I don't know, almost 10 years ago now maybe. And this article gets a lot of traffic every single day because this issue persists. So it comes and goes. Uh, these workarounds may help you uh, while you're experiencing an issue before Facebook updates it or for an issue like maybe the smooth scrolling with whatever system you're using, maybe that will fix it permanently. If you wanna help Facebook fix this issue and maybe even get a personalized response, you can submit a bug on Facebook by going over to your profile icon on the top right, clicking on it, and then going to the help and support option. From here, you can click on report a problem, and then you can let them know that something went wrong, and you'll notice that you can fill out this entire bug report right here. So I would probably choose performance, and then you can give them all the details about your specific issue, add a screenshot if you'd like, and submit it. And hopefully that will help them avoid having this issue in the future. If you have any other solutions that have worked for you, please post them in the comments section here on YouTube to help the other viewers. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, I would really appreciate a thumbs up here on YouTube. And if you wanna see more technology tips and tutorials, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. That's all I have for you for now. This is Anson from AnsonAlex.com.